Hi there! Welcome back to Stardew Valley. It has been five days for me, and I have to open up with some time travel. Yes, I do find this annoying. It's our way to see the wedding sequence. We have pulled out the save back up. We are going straight to bed so that we can watch this. And I can read it aloud for you all. We earned this. We deserve it. When Grimmeth first arrived in Pelican Town, no one knew if he'd fit in with our community, but from this day forward, Grimmeth is going to be as much a part of this town as any of us. It is my great honor on this day 18 of summer to unite Grimmeth and Haley in the bonds of marriage. Well, let's get right to it. Grimmeth, Haley, as the mayor of Pelican Town and regional bearer of the matrimonial seal, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may guess. So Haley required the three days to set up a temporal distortion a day between the 17th and 18th where we could all gather together and have a marriage ceremony in the town square. The day isn't taken up. We're going to show back up on the farm and it's going to be the 18th. It's going to be 6 a.m. Life is going to be different from now on. But the future looks bright. And frankly, that shows incredible power from her. So after the marriage ceremony, here we go. The start of the day. The wedding was wonderful, wasn't it, dear? Well, we can't forget about the farm. Time to get to work. Now, this is new knowledge for me to have discovered that when you launch your save and you're getting married on the day of the save, you don't actually have the wedding ceremony. When we go back into the real timeline, you know, after having played the 17th and gone to the Skull Cavern and given Sam his gift, I'm going to wake up in the house. We're not going to have the marriage ceremony play out for us. It's, you know, it's apparently my fault for not just going through another day or doing the wedding ceremony. I thought, surely the game will be sophisticated enough in the year of our Lord 2024 to allow me to handle all of that. Just load back up in and we could have a good time, right? No. Now, through this temporal hole that Haley has created, I have to insert my my thick fingers into it to, to brought us the sequence. Anyway, that's enough about that. Let's go to the actual timeline where we don't get to stand here and talk with Haley about that stuff and... We are married. Yay! Have any plans for the day? You mean other than the fact that we got married today? Nah, it's all good, it's all fine. Your spouse gets their own room add-on. This is Haley's. Adorable, just like her. We do miss out on all of her dialogue from her being single. But you know, we get the married life dialogue. And smoochies. There is no gift limit for your spout. But we have more hearts to fill in for Haley. We are going to be doing that. Remember, your relationship with your spouse does decay perpetually. I'm going to apparently fail how to use an interface because I I have a different video game in my brain. Like, I could just click down there and it'll be fine, right? Welcome to Kozu 5. Your number one source for weather, news, entertainment. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Our luck? Spirits are very displeased. We used all of it on marriage and temporal distortion. You admire that bear. Summer is known for its lightning storms. If you know how to craft a lightning rod, you can harvest the electricity and create battery packs. These can be sold or used for crafting. Why, yes, indeed, they most certainly can be. Let's check the mail. I see you've entered the Skull Cavern. Well done. I've got a better challenge for you, kid. Make it at least 25 levels deep. I've got a mountain of G to send 
if you can do it. Your friend, Mr. Name, that concerned ape has not provided an official pronunciation for. P, G, Q, Q, I, Mr. I know. Apparently they're our friend, and they are quite potent and powerful. Rest assured. Reach level 25 in the Skull Cavern. We hit, what, 17 on the 17th? Or we had to get back for Alex's birthday and all. All right, let's see if I can remember how the hell to play this game after several days. We'll probably just get into some kind of trouble or mischief. I can count on myself to, to handle that front. Something, something, bee houses, maybe, potentially. We might uh, not be heading to the desert skull caverns today. There's just other stuff and affairs I want to be handling, I think. I reckon that's probably true. But it could also not be true. I'm choosing to trust myself, which is very, very wild and reckless. Let's deposit that deluxe bait over yonder. You know, yonder. Didn't I have a... With frowns. Looking at the furnaces. Shakes his head. No, no, those must have been there due to the whole, like, temporal distortion bit. Yeah, it's fine. It's all good. I'm gonna sell this stuff, and I'm going to gift Haley a, uh... Loved gift. Because I'm kind of a badass. Hey, girl. She's just walking around admiring the house. Wow, they're beautiful. These are my absolute favorite. That's good. That's good. Oh, yeah, since I'm thinking about it, we're no longer on the market, but I think I'm going to bring you some quartz with me, along with these mystery boxes and varying flavors of geodes. Might as well bring this with me, too. The Omni geodes included. Is there anything else that Gunther needed to circle jerk over? Like, oh, oh yes, oh, I need to see that, oh. I, I, we could really use that in the museum, good buddy. Like, I'm not your good buddy. What the hell, man? Quit riding my dick. Like, you don't understand. Like, I do understand. <laughs> you need to lay the fuck off. That duck will be done at the end of the day. Huzzah. We have two more slots in the coop, but I will not throw any other animals at this time. Thinking about that, uh, that barn, you know, since we do... This is kind of the, the run we have going on, right? You know, raising animals and what have you. What seed flavors do I have? Radishes, apparently. Apparently that was the thing that I was doing. Cool. Great. Wonderful. I don't need to carry these around. If I'm not going. Uh... I think I'll carry the tools around, and I'll just buy the third pack level. But that does prohibit me from taking the cool minecart just to go to Clint's if I need the extra inventory space. Anything on the billboard today? Um, She wants my jade, does she? Yeah. We just met and she's already after. Perhaps the most precious mineral in the universe. <laughs> I can't blame her. Jade is pretty good. Alright, we'll keep that in mind. And tell you what. We'll get this shit resolved. Yeah. I got a plus one speed. Stuff's not open yet. Let's take the jade with us. Um, Demetrius' birthday is tomorrow, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure he loves... Um, Strawberries, like his daughter. Also the Trout Derby, which I've never seen before. It probably involves fishing of some kind. Trout would be my guess. Just call it a hunch. 
Do we have any other Pandas Thirsty Ride the Pale Ale? And the purple shorts. Right, 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 right. Go ahead and officially accept this. We'll get that delivered. She has a ticket for us. We definitely do. We take those. Yeah? What's good, man? We'll buy that. All right. Past the middle of summer. And I finally got my third row of inventory. Well, now that you have dual incomes, I expect you'll be purchasing twice as many seeds, right? I'm only joking. Look at that! Commentary on me being married with Haley. It's good stuff. Hey, Abigail. Hey, how'd you know I was hungry? This looks delicious. Quartz is a light gift for Abigail. And I'm glad this still hasn't been changed after all this time. This is her default words for light gifts. Abigail is a lithophore. And, you know... Maybe if we could play video games with her, or maybe, you know, if she would go, like, traveling with us and get into combat in the base game and what have you, I would let this lithovore around my penis. But as it stands, you know, her Abigail could be marriageable for me. I would marry this lithovore if there were other gameplay elements that could key off of her strengths. I knew how to use a sword to be exploring those caves by the mountain like right now. It's probably high school there. I could teach you. It's not even a sex joke. <laughs> Robin, you're always welcome to visit us, even if you aren't shopping, you know? It can get pretty lonely up here in the mountains. Uh, Maru went to go work. We have some events in here, though. I'm so sick of preparing these samples. Keep in mind that we've learned so many, well, we've gained so much relationship with all the villagers that there are so many events. Keep up, by the way. Yoba. Oh no! The whole sample is ruined. Harvey's going to kill me. Kermith, what should I do? Tell Harvey it was an accident. You're right. I should just tell him the truth. I told Maru the truth involving her dad. What happened? I heard something break. I accidentally dropped one of the samples. I'm so sorry. Thanks for telling me the truth, Maru. Don't worry about the sample. We'll just get another one. Thanks for being patient with me, Dr. Harvey. The word patient... Ah, uh, of course. You've been a big help around here. I don't know what I'd do without you. Aww. Hey. Griffith, you look a little pale. Are you feeling okay? Absolutely. Especially since I've just checked to confirm I am recording. Ah, <sighs> exasperated dots. We've got medicine for sale. Sorry, just thinking about some gadgets I'm making. I decided that I'm going to build a robot someday. It sounds challenging. You're right, but I love a challenge. This is why I can't marry Mara. She's out here building robots. Exercise and poor, but don't get too exhausted. You might enter my clinic. Make sure to listen to your body. Oh, I'm listening to my body. Today might be Robin's checkup day. hell a young person like you doing here uh each of the villagers have their own checkup days which interrupts their normal schedules it could today could be robin's i couldn't swear to it everything good in here hey Harvey, how'd you get here okay george i want you to take a deep breath for me mm -hmm. turn around please George, I'll be honest with you. You need to make some changes in your lifestyle if you want to stay healthy. I'd like you to reduce your sodium intake and try to get some moderate exercise with your arms. Hm. I know what's best for me. Who do you think you are telling me how to live my life? I'm your doctor, George. That's who I am. And I went to school for eight years so I could learn how to help people stay healthy. Permit me to shed some light on the situation. Oh! I'm sorry, but you shouldn't be here. These checkups are supposed to be private. It's true, I did just kind of walk in on that. 
Not so fast, I'd like to get a second opinion from this young man. Very well. Grimoth, what do you think George should do? All right. Since I'm stuck between only these two options and not a, yo, this is not my fucking business. I'm just gonna go with, uh, listen to Dr. Harvey on this one. Thanks, Grubbeth. You see, George, I'm just trying to help you. Fine, I'll do what you say, Doctor. Thanks for your help, Grubbeth. I appreciate it. I bet so. George? I can't talk right now, young man. My favorite program is on. The soaps. I'm very happy for you, dear. Seeing young people in love is heartwarming for old grannies like me. Oh, Evelyn. Just also, you know, poking my head in to visit people on account of the fact that I was married. I could get divorced. We're not doing it. Did you hear? It seems the old town bus started working again overnight. Wow! That old thing has been around for decades. This is truly... A great mystery. Congratulations, Griffith. This is a big step forward for you and Haley. You've really grown some roots in this town. That's that's not all I'm growing, man. <laughs> As I'm sure you know, what you pick up from the museum and all. Uh, not the museum. I have museum of my brain. I'm going to get this out of my inventory real quick. We could collect a rare crow momentarily, but I need the extra inventory space. An old farmer's journal been here for a year now, and I've started to make friends with the local townspeople. It sure feels great. They're sending me gifts and secret family recipes in the mail, too. That's really helpful. That's a hint for you that you can get gifts and family recipes in the mail by befriending the villagers. Clint, what's good, man? Interesting. There's tiny iridium flakes on your pickaxe. You've been going to the desert caves, huh? I've always wanted to smell with iridium. It's not easy to come by. <laughs> You'll charge me an arm and a leg to do it, that's for damn sure. Omni Geode. Get to work, man. Thunder Egg. Copper Ore. Whatever the fuck that is. Well, now we have two of them. Gunther will tell me so much. And then he'll chop me <laughs> across the, the chest. It'll hurt really bad. Substone. Okay, what's in the box? Hmm. We can make use of some deluxe speed grow next season. Yeah. I guess we could make use of quality fertilizer as well. Totem to the mountains. Eight corn seeds could technically be planted. Eight radish seeds could also be planted. More quality fertilizer. More quality fertilizer. Those are pepper seeds. It's a little late for those. Farm totems. Now those are really valuable. I could spend a lot of time in the desert caves. All right, we got some stuff for uh, ya boy. You know, ya boy. Everyone knows checks notes ya boy of course ya boy and mine allied and friend of all i did not bring the food with me that's okay let's actually use the mine cards this might be the first time i've used them since i had the junibos repair them hey pam i always seem to end up at the saloon at some point it's too close to my house it ain't healthy well let's get you further away from the saloon pam I love how the door closes while she's standing outside of the bus! Which then, you know, she has to come inside! This costs 500, but we're gonna be making a profit. Uh, there, of course, are items we need to haul back, like the stone. It is Sandy who desired this jade, yes? She loves them. She loves jade. Oh, you brought me the item I asked for. Thanks so much. Here's your payment as promised. Huzzah! We'll have to work on a relationship with her. A shady looking guy in the back and not supposed to talk about it. Anyway, what's the weather like in the valley? Hello, shady looking guy. 
dots, dots, dots. It's Bouncer. He's looking cool, man. Haley also does love coconuts, so if I find any gold star coconuts, we could uh, chuck those her way as well. What you got here? Some spicy eels, them triple shot espressos. Oh, yeah. This stuff right here. <sighs> Three prismatic shards. For some fucking magic rock candy. But look at how long those buffs last. Two mining, five luck, the speed, the defense, the attack. You combine this with a food that doesn't provide any buffs, like a salad? You're, you are good, man, for the day. 500 energy and 225 health on top of that. Those are so, so delightful to have. Didn't quite make it to level eight foraging, but we could change that. There we go. I want to quickly poke my head into the mines? I mean, I don't really have the inventory space for it, so no. <laughs> Short on cash right now, but we'll get more. This also is an opportunity for us to... Oh, yeah. We're thinking about this and remembering this for future things, which I will not say. I guess we'll just chop the rest of the trees while up here. There could be coconuts in them that I haven't gotten because I haven't shaken the damn trees. Or there could just be coconuts in them that fall, uh, even though I have shaken the trees. Just normal cookies, though. A mystery box of that one. Interesting. Don't mind me. Okay, just, I wanted to check something. My curiosity is unsatisfied. Our work here is done. We can now go. I do enjoy me some skull caverns. Damn. Uh, that took care of the request. It's been handled. That's great. I don't feel any compelling need to visit anyone right now. I can check the tappers for the day. Good, we got some jade done. Great. That is a, a thing in demand. Friday is going to be the day they have to deliver, but I mean, I only have one of those, so who gives a fuck? Lap these over here real quick. Just for my convenience. Nice to have that third row there. That's for sure. I love how I tried to merge stuff. And there wasn't anything in the damn chest. Just mental habit and all. <sighs> okay. Let's put that in there. The rare crow we can eventually make use out of. I suppose. No particular rush. I'll probably keep some of these cactus fruits. By some, I mean that many. We'll put those in there for now. I don't have a single copper ore, so let's put that in there. Not gonna keep the rest of these things. We'll keep that. That merge later, and we will just uh, sell these coconuts. Yeah. He said, keeping loved gifts. <laughs> yeah, but... Let's take these inside with me. Put you in here. Um, take this out of here. Pretty sure I can't sell scarecrows. Yeah. 
I can sell my prize tickets, though, for one dollar. That seems kind of bullshit. One crow. Not a whole lot of action over there. Compare that to two crows and six crows. Okay. We've also got some pine tar done. Let's check our, our fruit bat cave. To the bat cave! Okay. These things are needed for bundles. I haven't even, like, taken a look at those. This was a hard day because today was a, uh, you know, a wedding day for me. Remember, don't, uh, don't kill all the grass or else you're going to need some grass starters. Just know that I had some room in there. We'll, uh, we'll grab that pine tar on our way back up. Let's, uh, head for the deep woods. Let's take a look now before I make it to the deep woods. We're waiting on that stuff. That's fall. I haven't delivered a sunflower yet. Fall. Fall, basically. Winter. Fall. Fall. Mm. <laughs> fall. Winter, I guess? Waiting on a doll. Winter. Eh. Greenhouse, year two. You know, I didn't have to sell that one star fruit. Uh, there also was a star fruit I could have purchased from the Luau for 3000 No, no fuss about it. It's okay. Alright. We've made some great progress. Do not feel any particular pressure. But I do, of course, like to resolve that stuff because of the nice yummy benefits you get. Also, we did lose our spicy eel benefits. Key tragedy. It's a nice thing to take with you into there, too. Like the extra speed and what have you. Hmm. Was off looking at the bottom right corner of the screen. Now reflecting on the fact that I didn't bring a weapon with me. Definitely not the first time that's happened. When I was newer to this game, I was I was I was really great at carrying a weapon with me. And as uh I played the game more, I just, you know, end up bending it. And then, you know, I end up in situations like this where I'm like, that would have been handy. But I don't have it. Fucking slime just hunts me down. Thank you, magnetism. Yeah, you don't you don't want to enter range of my attack. I'm pretty spooky. Trust me. Alright. Why don't I make use of this? Use our resources here. I love how it was divided there. Hey, Abigail. How's it going? Maru's coming back home. Already spoken with Abigail for the day. There are... The worms are... Oh, three clay. Robin? You good? We've spoken to Robin plenty today. Bastion? Is not in. Is he having a smoke break? No, he's out by the railroad. I forgot that's a thing he can do. I know there was some moss there. Just running around. Wanted to uh, talk to a few more people on my wedding day. Thought about tying the knot once, but now I'm happily married to the wind rustling in the leaves and the frogs croaking under the silver moon. Hey man, it's all good. Linus, we can give him another gift. So let's just give him a spice berry. A great gift. Thank you. We're at four hearts with uh, our friend Linus now. He knows that I accept. Suppose that's a spot that a villager walked, uh, so the tree just fucking fell. As they do. Give that a good whack. 
Definitely don't want to go swimming if that's what you're going to ask. Oh, you just stopped to say hi? Sorry. I was not interested in you swimming. It's all good, though, man. It's all good. Looking here. Thinking to the future. Thinking to the future. All right. I could walk all the way in to dip into the pool to get my energy back. There's some more chopping. We did get our foraging level up. Always more work to be done. On that front. I'll tell you something I can do. Since I'm in the neighborhood. Come here, you weapons. Guess we'll take that, too. How you two doing? I... You know, I do not need a new sword. I want this fucking galaxy hammer. 75,000 G. Ugh. The weight for the knockback, the 70 to 90 damage, plus two speed. I mean, sure, okay, whatever. I mean, that's nifty and all. It's slower than the galaxy sword, but speed's not an issue. I want that extra damage. Well. So it goes. What kind of progress have I made here? 152 of those adorable dust sprites. I've killed 11 of 250 serpents. There's others we have yet to encounter. That's alright. shop this way. That one I'm not so sure about. I think I just leave that stuff there. Whatever. Hmm. Fucked up my chops. I'll take this one slow. Bring the atmosphere. Over there. We require the bridge to be repaired. There's actually a minecart bit that does lean over there, but that doesn't get fixed either until the bridge is repaired. The Junimos uh, did not do everything they could on that front. It's okay. Uh, one more tree for the road. Sure. I believe Haley goes to bed at 10 p.m. We don't get in trouble for going to, like, bed late or anything, so don't be concerned on that front. If you were. Sell these. Sell that stuff. Keep the prize ticket. Put the scarecrow in here, but I'm probably just going to end up junking those things. The normal scarecrows just for the rare crows. Gotta catch them all. Rare crow mon. It's you and me. I guess. <laughs> Probably. That's right, I scattered these tappers. Weirdly. And then the next thing I want to do is... Uh, collect the, uh, the 10,000 for a horse. There are definitely many times I've had a horse before I've gotten married. But <laughs> this is the world we live in. What a bizarre time it is. Okay. Uh, if we take a look at crafting. The iron bar. The oak resin we just got here. Uh, it's wooden coal? Wooden to copper bar. My bad. Let's make this now. We have a keg. The keg, the keg is in hand. Do 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 Oh goodness. Might uh might slap down a mushroom log. I know I do have still have those wild tree seeds that I haven't done anything with. 
recipe fertilizer, just fiber and stone. It's not an issue for us at this time. It's bee house, which when I get my... I do have some maple syrup. It's the coal. I'm, no, I, I, now I have the coal. The iron bar? Okay. Cool. Well, I picked all the flowers. That's okay, though. We can just get some generic honey. All right. Where do I want to place these? This kind of whole ugly industrial setup here at this time. Uh, I'm going to level up. That's going to be nice. Means uh, I can go to bed whatever time I want and be fine. Let's put this here. And let's put this. We have a beautiful range here. Uh, we'll put this down here by our scarecrow friend. Sort of like here, I think. So it's going to be producing wild honey. If there was a flower over there that changed that, then it would change it. I want to get a ale ale for Pam. Those don't take long to produce at all. We only have one tapper on an oak tree, right? With frowns. Yes, we only have one tapper on an oak tree. Tomorrow, I'm pretty damn sure is going to be a Skull Caverns day. Although, of course, it will be dependent on Ham, so it'll be a later start. I get cash in the prize ticket while I wait? Maybe I don't even bother. That's future Grimace thoughts. We're not really set up for industry, even though I planted all the fucking trees where I did. Whatever, man. I'm going to bed. For wedding night, damn it. I'll make warp totem farms. We gonna make tent kits? Question mark? The flowers we sold, along with a smattering of other things. The mayonnaise. A little bit of forage. And some mining. Alright, if I fuse this video together, it looks at length. Combined with the last bit, we should be under 40 minutes. Great, this... I guess we did have a number of events. We did have a number of events. Alright. I'll see you folks next time.